Hi there, it's Danelle. This morning I wanted to share a few thoughts with you about uh, transformation. Um, it's a word I use a lot and it's probably one of those really slightly vague words that gets bandied around and um, if you actually get down to it, people start to ask, well, what is transformation? Uh, transformation to me is about that process of the caterpillar that cocoons itself up and then emerges as a butterfly. It is this process by which we are changed and certainly for me I see it as an ongoing journey of change and improvement and discovery and uh, I guess a playful excitement at what might be coming next. It's a bit of an adventure. What does that mean in a business context? Well when we talk about transforming a business it's that process by which we come to understand where we are today, make some significant changes. So I'm not talking playing around the edges, I'm talking a massive overhaul in the way that you think about work, the way that you do work, the way that you lead, what it feels like to live and breathe and work in that company. And as, as I said, it's an ongoing journey. So this is not something that we start and then at some point we get to the end and we say, yep, done, we're transformed. No, it's this ongoing journey and this ongoing experience of discovery and curiosity and experimentation and the shift and the change that happens as a result of that. But you'll hear me say again and again and again, transformation is more than digital. And I firmly believe that you must do the work on yourself before you can do the real work on your organization. So it's all very well to go out there and say that change is gonna to happen to someone else. We're going to fire that team over there and move their work over to the Philippines. We're going to change the way that that team operates and the way they're structured. We'll break them up and get them reporting to some other managers. All very well to do that from a top-down hierarchical approach, but that's not transformation. The transformation bit becomes when you are participating in that process as a leader and it's about your change and how you change both as an individual and an individual operating a role in your business. That to me is the really powerful bit and I think it's the bit that most people miss. We go into change programs and we have a, a plan of what we want to shift and move but there's never any conversation about change happening to me and what does that feel like and I'm okay with that and most of the time I'm not okay with that happening to me and it's the messy dirty nitty gritty stuff of getting through how we need to change how we need to step up as leaders to be able to lead an organization in a new way uh, to be able to push forward on those boundaries of innovation and change and build a place that people love to work so probably more than enough preaching from me this morning. Um, as you can see, it's a beautiful day um, down here at the bottom of the Southern Alps in New Zealand. I hope wherever you are, you're having a fabulous day too. And we'll see you next week. Thanks.